Hello everyone and welcome back to Grilling and Smoking by Micah. Uh, today I'm going to do something kind of gimmicky. I um, was trying to think of things to, to cook so I came up with a bacon cheddar burger dog. So um, well, we'll just dive in and you can see what I'm doing. So I've, just, I've got some hamburger meat here. Season it up however you want. Um, just like I said, any, any way you want to season it. Um, I'm doing it like I would normally do uh, my burgers and if you've been watching my channel for a while you've you've seen how I do it I just usually put just a couple of ingredients in there uh, loosely loosely mix it up if you uh, mix it up too much it becomes meatloaf so I still like it loose like that um, I'm gonna grab a handful kind of make a loose ball out of it set it on a paper plate use one of my kids plates and smash it down and I'm trying to make a burger big enough that will cover a hot dog I want to try and get that just a little bit thinner. Okay, I got my hamburger patty made. So now what I want to do, I got two pieces of cheddar here. And what I'm going to do is just basically roll the hot dog up in the cheddar. Okay, once I've got the uh, cheddar on the hot dog, and actually it doesn't look too good, probably should have let the cheddar set out a little bit more to get closer to the room temperature. I am now going to roll this all up in the hamburger. Just kind of encase it all and the hamburger meat. Okay, once you get the uh, hot dog and the cheese all wrapped up in the hamburger, I'm just gonna take a couple of pieces of bacon and wrap it around. And then when this cooks on the grill, the bacon should shrink up and help hold everything together. Actually, I think I'm gonna get one more piece of bacon and put on there, and then we'll meet you at the grill. Okay, everybody, we're out the grill now. Um, I've got my bacon cheddar burger dog, and I just made some hamburger patties out of what was left. I'm just gonna use some seasoning pepper to put on the bacon cheddar burger dog and get this on the grill so i'm going to keep a close eye on that and we'll be back in a little bit okay it's finished grilling now and unfortunately it tore open on me a little bit but we're still going to cut into this thing see how it looks and see how it tastes so i'll meet you inside okay we're back inside now so here it is like i said it kind of ripped open on me um so i'm gonna, I'm gonna cut on this end the part that didn't rip open on me and we'll see how that looks and You see the hamburger, obviously. You see the hot dog. Looks like I could use a little bit more cheddar. It's got the bacon on the outside. Let's give it a try. It 
taste exactly like you expect. Taste, I can taste the bacon. I can taste the way I season the burger. You know, I don't taste the hot dog all that much. A little, little bit of the uh, cheddar flavor. Again, guys, like I said, it's kind of a gimmick cook. Uh, just trying to have uh, or come up with an idea of something different to cook. Um, I was actually going to put it on a hot dog bun, but as you can see, it turned out a little bit too big for a hot dog bun. So I think I'll just uh, probably put some mustard and ketchup on the side, dip it in that and eat it. Uh, so guys, I hope you liked it. It was something different to try. Um, if you did like it, please give me a like. Uh, please subscribe. Uh, share with your friends. Uh, just a reminder, I do have a page on Facebook. You can uh, follow me there and also on Twitter. Uh, just check the description down below for all those links.